Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel and welcome to this special uh, edition of the Piston Cup versus the NASCAR Cup. It's what you've been asking for and it's what you're going to get. Look at this chase race a lot on first place on pole. Ryan Laney in second. Jolt Line in third. Cruz Ramirez fourth. Chase Elliott in fifth. Spiky Phillips in sixth. Kevin Harvick in seventh place. Uh, Martin Trex Jr. in uh, eighth. Kurt Busch in ninth. Clint Boa 10th place, Kyle Busch in 11th, Denny Hamlin 12th, uh, look at this, Ryan Newman 13th, Wallace Jr or Bubba Wallace in 14th, uh, Brad is in 15th, Di Bandetto uh, is in 16th, Jimmy Johnson 17th, Ryan Blaney 18th, Joey Logano 19th, uh, they make up that whole literally top uh, 10 of cars and here we are guys this is what you've been waiting for we have a special a special race from lightning mcqueen he is making a huge uh, a huge appearance uh, today so uh, there is a lightning mcqueen uh, in the 95 fabulous lighting lightning mcqueen car uh, unfortunately starting down in 20th the retired driver from uh, full-time racing turning up today for this exhibition race. Drivers, start your engines! So we have engines starter orders and to begin this uh, great exhibition race between NASCAR legends and Piston Cup legends so as the pace car goes in we are about to get this race underway in its chase race a lot who's about to see that green light and green flag and he has and we're off the uh, 30 laps begin of this amazing uh piston cup versus nascar cup exhibition race here at daytona there's jimmy johnson down there uh, looking for this exhibition win to add to his seven NASCAR t Cup titles. And look at this. Three wide already into turn one, turn two. Wow, joke line going down on the inside one here. Uh, the first round of the season of the Piston Cup. Uh, jolt line doing extremely well. There's Chase Elliott behind. We've got Kevin Harvick, Martin Truex. There's Kurt Busch there as well. Looking to get to the front of this grid. So as we uh, go around the uh, track... Uh, a lot of the Piston Cup cars at the back, not doing uh, extremely well. I mean, Jackson Storm, what a terrible season uh, the number 20 is having. Uh, and there's a lot of Piston Cup cars at the back. These NASCARs uh, seem to be a lot quicker um, as we get to uh, the uh, the NASCARs. And as you can see, uh, we've got Austin Dillon in there. We've got uh, uh, Byron. There is uh, Lightning McQueen in that special edition 95 um he's not doing it extremely well but fighting his way to the front there's joey logano bubba wallace uh and our freight well my favorite jimmy johnson in there as well uh and the list sort of goes on there's newman uh then we got uh denny hamlin behind his his friend kyle bush uh, I'm sure they're going to uh, have a little bit of a, a fight for that position on the track there. Uh, uh, but look at this. At the front, we have two NASCAR drivers on lap four leading this race. Kevin Harvick and Chase Elliott. On lap seven, it's Denny Hamlin who's leading us around now in the FedEx car. Uh, but Ryan, Ryan Newman uh, hot on the tail of that uh, toy Ota. Both Fords now behind. Looks like Brad Kalowski about to give the number six a nice little nudge. So with lap 11 in full progress, Jimmy Johnson coming on the inside of Brad Kalowski in that Chevy. The 48 trying to be dominant here and try to get in first place. The seven-time champion, the most experienced driver here, uh, especially for championships. And uh, unfortunately at the back are uh, our Piston Cup hero uh, in the Rusty's uh, 95. Lightning McQueen struggling uh, down at the back of this grid. Will he have a chance to go uh, into uh, the lead here? We are on lap 12. There's a long way to go still, but uh, not expecting much from the 95 today. He's behind his old foe, 
Jackson Storm. Could he use Jackson Storm as a slipstream, maybe? Uh, and put himself along. William Byron uh, and Eric Almarola at the back uh, of this grid. Two NASCAR Cup cars struggling uh, at the back, unfortunately. Uh, but other cars are trying their hardest to get to the front of this grid, which seems to be uh, completely owned by the NASCAR teams. Lap 16 and Austin Dillon uh, and uh, it looks like to me Cole Custer on the uh, cusp of fighting out for first place. Even Eric Jones is in on this and we look like we have uh, Cruz Ramirez coming in on this race now. Spiky Phillips in there. Jimmy Johnson has uh, fallen back now. Cole Custer goes low. Can he make a move on first place or can one of the Piston Cup cars uh, make a move? So lap 21 and we still have an Austin Dillon lead in the number three. Cole Custer still behind. Not much has changed uh, in the ranks of this race. I've got to say the last couple of laps have been very, very like watching paint dry. Uh, and uh, I've got to say watching paint dry has been a little bit more exciting sometimes. So not much is going on in lap 23 at the back of the grid. As you can see a lot of the Piston Cup cars at the back. If we move further on in, we've got uh, Eric Almarola just in front of McQueen. So uh, one of the NASCAR Cup drivers not doing well. Uh, unfortunate to be with the Piston Cup guys. Even Danny Hamlin and Chase Elliott have fallen back, as has uh, William Byron by the looks of things. Lap 27 begins and we still have an Austin Dillon, Eric Jones lead at the front, Cole Custer still in third, Tyler Reddit in fourth and look at Wilbur Gearshift, is he now on his way to make a move to the front of this grid and show the NASCAR drivers how it's done? Lap 29 begins and we've got a free wide behind these leaders here, two laps to go, can Austin Dillon hold on to this lead and take that white flag? So Austin, Austin Dillon sees the white flag come out just in front of him now. We are on our last lap here. 30 laps have been completed. Oh, I should say haven't been completed yet. Anything could go wrong. But look at this car's pushing now to the front. Wilbur Gearshift so trying to get that lower part of the track. Cole Custer blocking that part as he's looking for a win himself. Eric Jones could also surprise us all with a win here, but it's Austin Dillon who's been the strongest driver today in this uh, exhibition race of Piston Cup versus NASCAR Cup. What a race it's been. We've had lots of different leaders, but at the moment, it's Austin Dillon we are more concerned about. Here he goes towards the checkered flag. Can he do it? Wilbur Gearshift's going to go for a last run, but I don't think he's got it. Cole Custer hasn't got it. Has Eric Jones? No! It is Austin Dillon by a millisecond. A millisecond. He wins the exhibition race between Piston Cup cars and NASCAR Cup cars. So there are your official uh, results and standings. Austin Dillon wins. Eric Jones second. Cole Custer in third. Tyler Reddick fourth. Eric Trunken in fifth. Wilbur Gearshift sixth. Ryan Blaney seventh. Spiky Phillips eighth. Cruz Ramirez in ninth. And Jimmy Johnson making up the top ten. Wow, what a race. And look at the front of that. Uh, look at the amount of uh, rookies we've got in the front of that uh, top ten. Uh, but as we go down, someone always has to finish last. And unfortunately, it was Danny Swerve. There's a lot of Piston Cup cars at the back, unfortunately. Uh, but also NASCAR Cup cars as well. On that note, guys, thank you for watching this special exhibition race between the NASCAR and the Piston Cup drivers. I hope you've enjoyed it. Don't forget to come back tomorrow for another upload. Hit that like, hit that subscribe, and don't forget to share. Take care, guys.